I'd like to show you how I use a Google Sheet add-on called Form Mule to send out dynamic emails. The application that uh, I'm going to use is the call for speakers form that I've created. This is a conference that I run. And um, the speakers will fill this out um, many times months before the conference. And so I want to make sure that I send them a confirmation email telling exactly, you know, the information that they submitted. So this is the form. It gets submitted and it goes into this spreadsheet here. Now, we've looked at other email notification tools previously. Google Forms has them. But... They're not as customizable as I needed. And so if I need to create something very dynamic and uh, custom, I'll use Form Mule in Google Sheets. Uh, the first thing you'll need to do is to install the add-on as we've done with others. So uh, just go to the add-on gallery and search for Form Mule. And uh, it'll bring you to this page here. Um, first thing is, you know, where is the data that we want to uh, use for these emails? It's in the form response one. And then we can uh, configure this uh, to run on form submission or on time. Very similar to Autocrat in that regard. Um, so I'm uh, configuring it to send automatically each time a form is submitted. And um, I'm going to go ahead and click on next. Now, this is the neat thing. Um, you can set up multiple email templates. Um, and so I have four set up. So I have one that's active right now. So anytime someone submits a application, they're going to receive um, an automatic reply. Later, after I finish reviewing and we decide which uh, applications we're going to receive or reject, um, I will use these two templates to send out the acceptance email or the rejection email. And so you'll notice that I have a status row in my sheet, again, very similar to Autocrat, so that if I add the word accepted into the column, then this template is used. If I add rejected, then this template is used. These aren't active right now because we're not uh, quite there yet. I'm going to go ahead and uh, move on to the next step. And this is where um, we'll actually write our email template uh, and can configure it. So uh, it, it's configured very similar to just a Gmail message. You um, are going to you'll see all the, the fields here. Um, similar to Autocrat, we can use the merge tags uh, from our form, from our sheet in the email itself. So we can address them by name, dynamically pull their email address. And then for this um, particular template, I'm sending them all of the session information that they've submitted. Um, all of your merge tags appear over here on the right, and you can just drag those in to the body of the email. So this is my submission email. I can toggle to my acceptance email, my rejection email, uh, which I haven't uh, created yet. So this is a great way to send dynamic emails. I could see this being used for um, discipline referrals, um, signing uh, discipline issues to different principals for parent um, volunteer signups, uh, explain their role, um, permission slips, and field trip information, uh, many, many different applications. But uh, this is Formule is one of the add-ons that I use a lot.